a surprising discovery made by the James Webb Space Telescope has captured the attention of the scientific world. The detection of urban light signals in space, located at a distance of 7 billion kilometers from Earth. This unexpected finding has sparkled great interest in the possibility of extraterrestrial life. By focusing on Proxima Centauri b, the closest exoplanet to Earth, the telescope revealed the presence of unusual bright lights emanating from its surface. What could be the cause of these unusual lights on Proxima Centauri b? Could they indicate the existence of light beyond our own planet? For years, mankind has longed and searched for signs of life beyond our own solar system. Any hint suggesting the possibility of this fantasy has been greeted with great enthusiasm. Recently, the scientific community was stunned when the James Webb Space Telescope captured compelling evidence for the existence of life forms in space. While exploring the cosmos and transmitting critical data back to Earth, the telescope observed unique urban lights coming from the exoplanet Proxima Centauri b. These lights, as their name suggests, are the first to be seen in space. These lights, as the name implies, appear to illuminate a distant city. The idea of the existence of an alien civilization in this star system has perplexed scientists, filling them with wonder. Each is baffled by the possibility that this is a discovery they have been all waiting for. If confirmed, it would mean that there are intelligent life forms that have developed societies beyond our comprehension in outer space, and we are just beginning to discover it. Observing these urban lights from a distance of 7 billion kilometers, NASA engineers wonder how long they have been glowing in space, waiting for mankind to develop the technology to detect them. David Kipping, an astronomer at Columbia University, characterizes the exoplanet Proxima b, where the urban lights have been sighted, as a celestial body with peculiar heating patterns that differ from those observed on other planets. While conventional rocky planets tend to absorb sunlight and emit infrared radiation, this exoplanet exhibits a markedly different infrared nature from its host star, Proxima Centauri. This peculiarity has allowed careful observation by the James Webb Space Telescope, the JWST. Since this instrument is highly sensitive to infrared wavelengths, the thermal signature of Proxima b will play a crucial role in investigating the universal secrets of its atmosphere, taking advantage of the JWST state-of-the-art infrared imaging capabilities. Scientists plan to use this telescope to unravel the planet's atmospheric mysteries as well as to assess its potential habitability. The JWST, with its exceptional infrared sensitivity, is equipped to probe the nights on Proxima Centauri b, because it can pick up even the faintest light signals in the cosmic darkness. It becomes the ideal tool for verifying the existence of possible city lights in the night of Proxima b. JWST's ability to detect artificial illumination in the cosmos is due to its ability to operate within an extremely narrow frequency band a thousand times narrower than starlight. Proxima b exhibits an interesting relationship between its stellar features and its surface interactions. With its daytime side adorned with solar panels that harness the energy of its host star, while its night side time experiences cold temperatures. The temperature variation on Proxima b as determined by its atmosphere composition is an intriguing topic for astronomers and the JWST can effectively probe the planet's thermal emissions to provide crucial data on its atmospheric properties. In addition, JWST's orbit around Earth aligns with the orbit of Proxima b, allowing full observations of its diurnal and nocturnal cycles in 11.2 Earth days. The next step will be to assess the atmospheric chemistry on Proxima b to determine its potential to support life. Focusing on the presence of gases, such as oxygen, water, 
vapor, and methane as key indicators of habitability. If elements such as oxygen, water vapor, and methane are detected in the planet's atmosphere, it could mean that it's capable of supporting habitable conditions. However, this process is extremely challenging as it involves the meticulous captured and analysis of the light rays passing through the planet's atmosphere. Although the James Webb Space Telescope, the JWST, has great capabilities for characterizing planetary atmospheres, its focus is primarily on analyzing variations in the concentration of water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane. Detecting oxygen, a crucial indicator of life, is more limited for the JWST. Despite these limitations, the telescope still looks for other elements such as ozone, which may also provide clues to the planet's habitability. It is important to keep in mind that the JWST cannot explore all potential habitable worlds, as it has limited capabilities and can only observe some of the exoplanets closest to Earth. Therefore, astronomers are turning to ground-based observatories such as the extremely large telescope, the LELT, which is expected to become operational in 2028 and allow for a deeper investigation of the atmospheric structure of distant exoplanets. Scientists eagerly anticipate the development of future space telescopes that will expand our understanding of exoplanetary exploration. Although the JWST has limitations, so to say, it remains a crucial tool for unraveling the mysteries of distant exoplanets. However, future space telescopes will aim to reduce the glare from host stars in order to better study light reflections from the exoplanets themselves. This presents additional challenges, as scientists must distinguish between gases produced by life and those generated by geological processes on the planet. Despite these challenges, scientific advances continue to move forward, and the Webb Telescope represents a step forward in our understanding of exoplanets and the universe in general. Despite an exhaustive search in all corners of space, scientists have not yet succeeded in finding any planet capable of supporting life. Throughout decades of research and search of signs of life in the cosmos, the question still remains. Are we alone in the universe? If you liked the video, don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss more content like this one. Thank you so much for watching the video and I'll be seeing you in the next one.